Hey friends, how you doing? Back here. Hey, uh, I'm relatively new. Well, I've been around YouTube uh, for a couple years, but didn't really get involved into it too much until this last fall. Um, this is my personal channel, not a biggie. I mean, I only have 18 subscribers. Just playing around with it. Um, got a lot of views just because of this one video I did here with Chris Bodie playing our national anthem. Pretty awesome, by the way. Um, and, uh, yeah, NFL claimed a copyright on it, but they allowed it to stay up and they monetized it. So I don't care. I don't want to make money off of it. Um, I just wanted to share a high quality HD video. All right. Well, with that being said, um, I was starting, I've got another channel that is starting to get more activity and I've got a lot of subscriptions going for it. And, um, you know, I wanted to organize them a little. So I went looking on here on YouTube and for a video. And uh, the best I could tell was um, YouTube allow used to allow you to do that or provided for you to do that, I should say. And um, it used to be down here under manage um, your channel. And anyway, uh, that was there no longer. Well, I stumbled on a little plugin for Chrome called Feedbro, and uh, the video that was there wasn't, I mean, it was it was good, it was enough to get me going, but it wasn't quite, uh, it was a little confusing, and I thought it should be a lot easier, so once I did, it only took me like about 10, 15 minutes to get it up and running, so I thought I'd just do my own version here and try it out, and um, let you know how it works, so like I said, you have all your subscriptions over here, um, you know, and if you want to browse channels and look and get any kind of organization, you can. Uh, but they're all, you know, pushed to you or fed from YouTube, like music or sports, uh, gaming probably here, uh, you know, news, those types of things. And, you know, this is the best of the best. A lot of you can pick them out. I haven't gone into that deep, but... Um, let's say you have your own subscriptions, okay? And, well, how do you get those in to organize them and do what you want? You know, there's recommended channels over here. Well, um, there is a way around it. It's pretty simple, and it's actually pretty cool. Um, you're just going to click on, in this area where you have your manage subscriptions, you're going to click that. And it's going to show you. Now, you see I only have 32 subscriptions in this personal page. But, you know, that's it. It's me. Um, and your ability to sort are really by, you know, either A, or Z, A through Z, new activity, most relevant, so on and so forth. Well, here's the workaround to the cool plugin. Before I show you the plug plugin and we go over there, um, here's what you need to do. Go down to the bottom of that Manage Subscriptions. You see the line that says Export RSS to RSS Readers. So you're going to export all the subscriptions that you have on this page. It's going to give you a little file down there in the bottom left. You want to remember where that file is. So you can show it in the folder. You can move it. You can do anything you want with it. You can see I've done a few of them, but that's number four. Okay. So if I wanted to do that, I could easily, you know, I know where it's at. All right. So next we do, uh, thing we do is we wander over to the Chrome store. And I'll type that in. And if you don't have it already, you're going to go in here and you're going to type in Feedbro. hit enter and it comes up and it's an advanced read feeder uh you know read news and blogs everything it's rated pretty highly the interface is simple now you can see i have already added it to my extensions but you would just click in there install it and it's going to be in your extensions and when you do that you're going to look up over here in the right hand side and you're going to see it, it's up here now it's showing 549 that's my total from my other page uh, or my other subscription. That's the total videos I have in there. So what you do is you click on that and you'll see, you know, your, your feeds in there in this format. 
But let's go ahead and what you do, and I'll get you up and running on this, and you'll see, and then you can play with all the other things you want to do. There's two ways to do it. You could click on options and do it that way, or you can just open the feed reader itself, or the uh, right here, and you can see it. Now, um, we'll get in in a second, but what we're going to do is we're going to imp import feed subscriptions as OPML. That's the file that you exported from YouTube your channel and over here on the left you'll see you'll have really nothing ex and none of this will be in there yet because you haven't export uh, imported anything yet and um, so what you do there's a number of ways to do it too uh, right here's this and then this will be also the way you visualize or how you look at your RSS feeds it's pretty cool so the first thing you want to do get it up and running quick is just go ahead click on here and you'll see you come to an options page uh, I chose dark on the theme this is goes to light here so a lot of other options you can put in here but um, that you can do on your own figure out I didn't spend a lot of time on it but um, uh, yet I've been playing around with it a little bit but uh, you want to import your feed subscriptions now in this case, I had shared or uh, saved my subscription manager right within my, uh, I made a special file folder so I know where it was at. Um, and the last one we just did basically in downloads and it was number four, I think it was, uh, yeah, we'd have a subscription manager number four. So you know what, I'm going to go ahead and import it because I can easily uh, delete it afterwards and I'll show you. It'll come up, says feeds successfully imported. You go, okay, cool. So then we're going to go back into FeedBro here and we're going to open the feed reader. And you're going to see I have two, okay. So my one channel is 495 or so and this is 418. So these are all of your subscriptions. So in this case, if I hit that button, here you go. There is the latest feed from all of those channels which have an external feed RSS. Pretty cool. Um, you can change over on the right here. I'll just say first before you choose them, you can change the view. You can, to you know, different views that you like or what you want so on and so forth, right through them there, okay? Um, I kind of prefer this one because then I can see it and I can click on any one of these as I scroll through showing all of my feeds, okay? Now, one thing I did notice, so right from here you can click and play it. It may or may not, I, I think if I unlock the subscription or play it once, I may get an error message on the YouTube, but you just plug on through to YouTube to watch it. Today's mission, no. Fernandina Beach, go. Florida, we to Sarasota, Florida. Here we go. Cool. I love airplanes. Um, okay, all right. So you kind of got the idea there, all right? Now what you have over here on the left then is, these are my other ones, but I have this one that I just brought in, and this be my personal one. and. Okay, so here's everything that's lined up off of my personal one. You know, just ones I was doing. And basically, you can go ahead and say, hey, I want to add a new folder. So let's just say, for instance, uh, flying. Let's make a folder called flying or flight or planes, whatever. Okay, see it shows up down here. Now, you can take this individual feed um, this was uh, what this was for flight. Um, hmm, what's his sound dog? He gave it all. Steve, Steve One Canevo, pretty cool. He's uh, got a he does some really cool uh, camera stuff right in the plane with him when he's flying live. So there is Steve O One Canevo. So there you go. If I go to his feed, you can see all of the different videos right there that he's done and upload to his channel and his feed. So now I can take this and I can just drag this down into that flying folder, okay? And uh, I'll give you another one as an example. Uh, you know, I like Flight Sim 2, which uh, 
I have that through the Steam, which is really cool. And let me find this gentleman. He's got a really, uh, Jordan King. There he is. Really does some great, I mean, this is computer simulation stuff. I mean, talk about being a geek and loving it, but uh, it really some great things. I mean, you know, uh, it's hard to believe. Um, and maybe we'll see if it gets through. If it doesn't. Oh, yeah, there we go. I'm going to visit the sky today. That's his video. Okay. A little plug for you there, Jordan. Uh, you can take this and you can drive it down into flying. So you kind of get the idea here. So then you can, you're, you're going to be able to, you know, just like uh, Windows or whatever, any file folder system, Mac that, you've got them all uh, organized over here. And there's another part about adding. I go into that later if you want to, but it's basically going up in here and adding an RSS feed. You look at the page source and you find it. You can find pretty easy how to do that. But um, getting back to this, I thought it was pretty cool. Again, it's called FeedBro, and it's really pretty phenomenal. And it uh, helps you manage all of your uh, YouTube subscriptions. And uh, like I say, you hit them here and you've got every one of them. You can see, hey, which one's catching your eye today, the latest one you're doing, and, and go you know check it out so anyway i hope you like that just a short little you know video for you to show you um very simple plug-in very simple to get up and running and um it'd be cool if this was built into youtube but it isn't but here you go and this is the alternative for you and it works so uh i hope you enjoyed it hey you know give me a thumbs up i guess is how they say all right y'all have a good one take care and be safe